Period. But we here, and she ain't never motherfucking left. <laughs> Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank y'all so much for joining me in today's smoke session. I wrote down some questions. Hold on, because my... But yes, y'all, I wrote down some questions that I wanted to ask myself for today's video. I'm so excited to be filming. I was going to do a Get Ready With Me smoke session, y'all. I swear to God, I got all my makeup. So, first of all, let me show y'all this palette, okay? Look at this side, y'all very much eating. First of all, let's appreciate the camera quality too. <laughs> Y'all, I swear to God, I just got a notification that I gained a subscriber. But the reason I was looking at that like that is because the person name was Jordan. Well, but then that'll be me telling y'all. The person last name was my last name. Girl, do we know anybody? Do we know each other? <laughs> but okay, y'all, anyway. <laughs> Yes, y'all, cool. Well, let's get into it. I got my two blunts in an ashtray right here. Let me go in here and do a little thumbnail action or something. Okay, hopefully I got some good thumbnails. I ain't even want to show y'all that because my handwriting OD, just OD bad. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. <laughs> because I know this is what y'all waiting on. This is what I'm waiting on too. Okay. If y'all got y'all blunt, y'all bow, y'all bone. Y'all back for y'all paper, y'all sparking y'all shit with me. But now we focusing so much on buddy last name and not that I increased the subscriber, y'all. I am so grateful. It's very much giving what it's supposed to give. And I just want to say thank y'all. So if you come into my channel and you're new here, go ahead. If you fuck with the vibes, go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe. Because guess what? I promise you, you're going to love it here, okay? Let me go ahead and get into the question for a while. Yeah, because it's just the first one. Mom, I already like, girl, up this being full, but... Okay, y'all, so the first question is, what is one conspiracy that I believe in? I feel like I really could go on and on and on and on about, like, different things that I that I be thinking, you feel me, that go on in this world. But, okay, one conspiracy that I believe in is as above, so below. So, like, if it's life up here, you feel me, on Earth, in the water, and you feel me, like, of course, above, like, in the sky. But with the ocean thing. I truly feel like people exist in the ocean, like mermaids type shit. I feel like they could, you feel me, like talk, like you feel me, human features and all that shit. So that's one conspiracy that I believe in, that there's life underwater. Let me actually add another one. I don't feel like these motherfuckers have ever touched space. No, y'all for real, every time a rocket ship has went up, literally immediately comes back down. Y'all not touching space. Y'all not touching God. Y'all don't know how to move look, baby. Not physically stepping on it. You not God like like that. You can't do it like that. I don't think so. Try again. Okay. <laughs> the next question is, how many children do you want? Y'all, I am the only child, so I really want a huge family. I used to tell my friends I want eight kids. And the number eight, now that I think about it, signifies like abundance. Um, so I feel like that's so beautiful. Now in my life, I feel like how many of them you feel me like I desire. So I really want a big family. I think I can need it. I can dance. The next question is, what is your favorite song right now at the moment? G Herbo, Locked In. My boy just, it's just giving classic. You Herbo, y'all, one of my favorite rappers. That's why we got Pull Up, the instrument will pull up as my intro song. Period. Eating. Yeah. <laughs> the next question is, what's one thing you love about yourself? Oh, for real, I love my smile. I love my dimples. four things so physically mentally emotionally and spiritually spiritually i love how close i'm getting with god right now in my life emotionally i love how i love people and i love how i love myself or how i am 
becoming more in love with myself physically i love my smile and then mentally i say mentally with my mind i love how i've been able to just transform my mind and accept change like it just motivate myself for real so those are four things that i love about myself constantly tell yourself to tell yourself how much you love yourself and how much you appreciate yourself and the things that you appreciate about yourself and even like if you're trying to like manifest something with yourself like say for instance you truly don't feel like you are beautiful constantly tell yourself you're beautiful as an affirmation every day until you really believe that shit don't let up look in the mirror i am beautiful I am beautiful, I am beautiful, I am beautiful, I live in the mirror right now, <laughs> I constantly continue to tell yourself because the fuck you are, period, and to until you believe it, to actually start embodying that beauty that you, you feel you desire for yourself. Spark this next one, y'all. Go ahead and drop a pink heart in the comments if you're enjoying this video right now, and I love pink, y'all, I got this pink right here. The next question is, are you a sensitive person? Hell motherfucking yeah. Very sensitive. Like, the last time I cried was yesterday. And I cried because somebody said something to me. And I literally just had to meditate because I recognized that what they said to me was a projection. It was like a joyful crying on my Like, I recognized, like, this is why. Sometimes we have to relearn things, y'all, because of the things that we were taught. And that affected me so bad. So, yes, I am very sensitive. Sorry, I had to do so real quick. The next question is, who is your celebrity crush? <laughs> First of all, I don't feel like I really believe in the word celebrity. I feel like we all are truly special. To utilize celebrity as a definition to put, you feel me, like somebody above somebody, I don't like that. Don't, you feel me, put celebrity like, okay, we not in the same category, we not in the same bracket. Because I could very much meet you and be in the same room, vibing in the same energy. So, like, don't do don't do something, say something, say something, say 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 something. Don't do it. Maybe my husband gonna be a an NBA player or a football player. <laughs> the first one is Jalen Hurts. He is an NFL quarterback for the Philadelphia Eagles. Y'all already know I love Philly. I done went to Philly before. Philly, 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 Philly. Yeah. I went to Philly like twice, y'all, three times, something like that. Vibe, vibe, vibe all time. And then the next person is John Moran. He is an NBA point guard. All right, y'all. So, okay, hold on, y'all. I'm going to be right back. 